We are back with another six at six. Let's start with number six. We're looking at the last remaining witch house in Salem, Massachusetts. It's the only building still standing with ties to the Salem witch trials of 1692. A man named Jonathan Corwin lived there. He was a civic leader who investigated claims of diabolical activity and women accused of being witches. He ultimately sent 19 women to the gallows, despite no proof of any witchcraft. Uh, these days, it is a museum. Number five, drove spiders are invading parts of Georgia and South Carolina. It is not uncommon for, uncommon for people to come across them, but where there's one, there are hundreds. And it's freaking people out a little bit, especially because of the large webs the spiders are weaving. But drove spiders are not a threat to humans. They prefer mosquitoes and flies. So oh, they're big. actually helping yeah. people. Wow. But wow. that looks a little frightening. But they get rid of mosquitoes and flies, so I think that's a good. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Jennifer, right? Yes. Sure. They can't help that they're scary looking. If they were covered in fur and had big cutesy eyes, everybody would look. <laughs> oh, yep. let's put a leash on it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. All right, number four, before you do your holiday shopping, here's something to think about. Yeah, that is kind of early for holiday shopping. According to some retail scientists, nearly 60% of Americans would rather take a vacation than have a traditional family get together this year. Hmm. So our advice to you, you know, just skip all that usual stuff. Who needs the turkey and stuffing? Take the family up to the Dells. And I'm sure grandma's going to live forever. Don't worry about <laughs> yeah. it. She'll be there How next year. It? And there's always next year and the year after that yeah. and 10 years from now. Her 87th or 88th <laughs> Christmas, they're all going to be there. Just, Don't yeah. worry. Wait a decade. You'll right. be fine. <laughs> Number three, be like Helen Mirren. She had made a decision to go gray a few years ago. Mirren told People Magazine that people are scared of doing it because going gray signifies they're in a different age group. But Mirren says, of course you're in that age group. I'm sorry, but you are. So why not just embrace it, go along with it, and welcome it. Make it a positive thing as opposed to a negative thing. Yeah. Okay, when you look like <laughs> Helen Mirren, though. Yeah. yeah. I mean, you could wear yeah. any hair color. Yes, she could have, have no hair it. and be beautiful. Yeah. If it was me, <laughs> I'm no Helen Mirren. That's all I'm saying. She looks good. Yeah, she looks great. Number two, a follow-up to a kissing story we told you about yesterday. Less oh. than half of the world's cultures kiss romantically. According to makeout scientists, romantic <laughs> kissing is the norm in the Middle East. 73% of people in Asia enjoy it. In Europe, the number is 70%. In North America, 50% of people mm -hmm. kiss romantically. But in Africa and Central America, it is just not done. According to the makeout scientists yes. at the so makeout university. 50% kiss romantically, the others don't kiss or kiss in a different way. <laughs> what are we saying? Jake. Yeah. What? A nice letter. How you doing? A nice typed letter. Yeah. The letter in the bottle. You when you cut out the magazine letters and you put on a letter. Yeah. That's, That's creepy. Yeah. yeah. All right, number one, let's take a tour of the Lion House. This is a three bedroom cottage set within the world famous GG Conservation Wildlife Reserve and Lion Sanctuary. You're never more than 20 feet away from a lion at wow. night. You can be lulled to sleep by the gentle chorus of 70 magnificent lions mm -hmm. roaring at one another. You'll we'll also have access to other wildlife like a zebra or an ostrich, even a wildebeest. I think that fence is too tall. <laughs> Make it shorter. It doesn't look that sturdy, if you ask me. I'm no engineer, <laughs> but. <it? laughs> well, that's the thing all falls down. Yeah. All right. Keep them well fed. <laughs> right. Hey, Mike. 